Should be all live now. Uh, yes, we are indeed live. Hello, everybody, and welcome to my Crash Team Racing Nitro Fueled playthrough. Doing uh, this one live, so uh, let's jump in and have some fun, shall we? Oh, it's been so long since I played this game. A 42 page license agreement. No, thank you. And I'm just going to skip all the way to the end. Ooh, right. Uh, another 28 page agreement. Okay. Right, there we go. So, what have we got? Uh, pit stop? Mm, nah, online? Not yet. Local arcade? Not yet. And adventure? Let's go. Let's just jump straight into it. Play the original experience just like it was back in the days. One character from beginning to end, no customization or difficulty settings, but still get all the rewards. Okay, that sounds pretty interesting to be honest. Nitro fueled. Play with any item you have unlocked. Switch and customize your count and cart as you see fit with different difficulties. Okay, um, we'll just stick to medium, I guess, and start. Right. Let's have a look at what we've got. So, I did get the uh, limited edition, uh, the nitrous oxide edition. So, we do have uh, a few extra goodies here. So, let's take a look at what we've got. Uh, there's quite a lot of uh, characters, actually. I think I'm probably just gonna stick to uh, Crash, to be honest. You know, I mean, it is a Crash game, so I think we should probably play as Crash. Ooh, different skins. What have we got? We got Retro. We got the uh, updated version. We've got Star Crash, Space Costume, Electron. Uh, ooh, that actually looks pretty cool. And yeah, that's all we've uh, unlocked for now. So we'll we'll just go with normal, you know. We'll we'll keep this plain and simple. 
Right, let's take a look at what I can do with the cart. So we've got the hovercraft because it was the uh, nitrous oxide edition. But I don't think changing the cart actually does anything. But it seems there's quite a few uh, customizations, so that could be pretty interesting to get them all. But again, we will stick to the classic. Uh, paint jobs. Wheels? Do I have any wheels? Uh, no, not really. Oh, they actually look pretty cool. I, I want them. I want them. Paint jobs. What have I got? Okay, so it's just literally the entire colour, it seems. Oh, I like the red one. I do like the red, to be fair. I think I might have to go red, guys. I might have to go red. Yeah, I'm going red. I'm going red. Definitely going red. Oh, and apparently you get a trophy for changing the colour. Nice to know. Nice to know indeed. Now, what stickers have we got? got some PlayStation stickers. Uh... Nothing else unlocked. No, I don't think there's anything else unlocked as a uh, as a default, which is a little bit of a shame. But you know, what can you do? I mean, I'm guessing you want like these probably aren't going to be that difficult to unlock, to be honest. Uh, what's this car set? Oh, I think these are just uh, like pre-made sets, if you will. Right, let's jump into it. Let's start the game and have some fun. Oh, I've been waiting for this for such a long time. Like, such a long time. It's like, this This is my childhood right here. This is absolutely my childhood. I, don't, I can't even think of how many hours I've spent playing this game growing up. Oh, I can't wait. I'm, I'm, I'm just, I'm so excited to really jump into it. And then the graphics just look amazing. They've definitely done a very good job on this remaster. Greetings, creatures of this planet. I come to compete. Volume's a little low, though. So you pesky Earth slugs like to race, eh? <laughs> well, I, Nitrous Oxide, am the fastest racer in the galaxy. I travel the stars. Looking for creatures to test my skills. It's a little game I call Survival of the Fastest. Here's the way we play. I challenge the best driver of your world to a race for the planet. If your driver wins, I'll leave your miserable little rock alone. But if I win, I will turn your entire globe into a concrete parking lot and make you my minions. I wonder how many cars you could park on a planet-sized car park. I, I imagine it's a lot, right? Like, you could definitely park a lot of cars on a planet-sized car park. Oh, these graphics! See, Tiny, Tiny takes after me. Like, well, I should say I take after Tiny there. He's, he's, he's a tiger after my own heart. Good old dingo. <laughs> oh, it's gonna be so good. Oh, oh my days, just look at these, like, just look at the graphics. Welcome to the adventure area. You can travel around this area and practice your driving skills. The dots and stars on the map represent warp pads which lead to races. When they flash, it signifies they are open to play. To access a race track, drive into a warp pad that has an active warp vortex, and it will take you to the track's starting line. Finish the track in first place to win a trophy. As you collect more trophies, other tracks will unlock. Good luck and drive fast. Alright, let's do this, guys. Let. Okay, so R2 is not accelerate. Right, where are the controls? I, I want to change that. Uh... New. Uh... Can I not change 
controls. Right, that's jump. Go. Hmm. It's going to take a bit of time to get used to these controls. Definitely going to take some time. Alright, let's just uh, do a race. Well, it's like I can't remember the last racing game I played that X was uh, Accelerate on. I think ever since like the PS3, it's always been R2. That's going to be a little awkward to get used to. Like that, That's going to take some time, that is. That is going to take some time to get used to. Right, a crash cove, the lovely beach. Ooh, fierce race. How badly am I gonna do? Hopefully not too badly. Like I, I don't want to embarrass myself on the first race. Okay. Uh, right, so circles using the. Uh, Items. Whoopsie daisy. Totally meant to do that. Like, absolutely intended. Oh, I thought that was the shield. No, that's the shield. No! Please tell me jumping still gets it off. Yes, it does. Nice. Oh, and there's a trophy for it as well. Oh, I missed him. Come on, come on. Oh, I want to shoot it in front of me. <laughs> Fire a couple behind me for good old measure. Oh, someone overtook me while I was doing that. Have a rocket, buddy. Okay, have another rocket, buddy. Never mind, I missed. No! I missed him again! No! Come back here. You know, after playing Team Sonic Racing, the drifting in this is a little hard to get used to. Try this again. No. Completely forgot you have to do it twice. And I failed. I failed! Second place. Jin beat me. I mean, second place for a first race. Not, not too bad, not too bad. Not great, but not too bad. Alright, let's do it again. Now that I'm a little more comfortable with the buttons, I guess. Right, we got this. We got this. Let's go, Jen. Like, you're the one I've got my eyes on now. <laughs> oh, no! Now that is karma. That is absolute karma. Oh, I didn't get anyone with that. Come on, give me something good. No, oh, I don't really want a shield. Oh well, at least I still hit him. At least I hit him. Nah, that was that was bad. That was that was really bad. Come on. Jin's in first again. I don't think the original game was on normal difficulty. No, not again! Stop using rockets on me! Yeah, I think the original might have been a bit easier than this. Normally, you're overlapping people. Well, that's actually quite a good thing, to be honest. It's like a lot of PS1 games were a little too easy. So it's nice to have that little bit extra challenge. 
One, got you. Alright, Jen's in first again. Wow, Jen is miles ahead. Come on. Yeah, Jen is just absolutely tanking this race. I'm probably going to lose this one again, to be fair. Well, if only I had that mask a little bit earlier. Jen beat me again, man. Alright. Come on, Jen. Come on. Let, let's have a fair race now. we got to have a fair race. So I've got to try and get used to the uh, drifting boost. No, oh, not the missile! Come on, really? Like, so soon? That's twice in a row that I've been hit at the very start by a missile. Oh, and I missed the box then. Oh, I missed him again! At least I'm in first now, though. But Jin is right up there again. Oh yeah, mask. Let's go. Let's go. This should get me a nice little bit of a lead, to be honest. Oh, and a boost right after. Ah, oh, failed that one. Come on. Come on, first race, first win. Let's go. Alright, I've got a bit of a comfortable lead now. So, I should be good this race. I should be good. Can, I, can you still jump up there? Oh, you can. Nice. Oh, and there's even a trophy. Wow, there's a lot of trophies that are really easy in this game. Oh, someone went after me with a missile then as well. The boosting is definitely going to be a little tricky to get used to. There we go. It only took three tries. Only three tries. Oh, man, that is definitely not as easy as it used to be on the PS1. Oh, I can't believe it. it actually took me three races to win the first one, though. I'm kind of looking forward to the, uh, like, last couple of races. Mainly the boss races, because they uh, they could be a little difficult even on the PS1, especially against uh, Nitrous Oxide. So I'm definitely looking forward to that. My first of many trophies. Wait, is that like a zombie gen or something? I think that's a zombie gen. Congratulations. You win a trophy. I do win a trophy. You can go faster through turns by power sliding. Press the power slide button while performing a hard turn. Okay. Ooh. Oh, and more stickers. Congratulations. You have just earned your first customization item. You can change and customize your character and card. Okay, I'm not really going to customize anything. What I am going to do, though, is change character. Because Crash just doesn't really have the speed that I want. I want something with uh, more top speed. Hmm... Alright, so Crash is two off everything. Let's have a look. Crash is two off everything. Hmm. Engine does have good acceleration. So does Nitrous, though. Hmm. 
I'm gonna go with Zam. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna go with Zam. It's like I want more top speed. The tuning's definitely a little tricky on this character though. Alright, Ruse Tubes, let's go. Let's have some fun. And hopefully not mess up as much as I have been doing. I hope. Come on guys, wish me luck. Wish me some luck. Let's go, let's go. We got this, we got this guys, we got this. We absolutely got this. And I need to get used to this track as well, because this is the one where you face the first boss on. And I completely butchered the start there. Oh, straight in between the boxes again! I seem to keep doing that lately. Okay, I messed up there. That was a bad drift, that was a bad drift. I really wish I could change the controls though, to be fair. It's like, I'm not a fan of this control layout. I mean, I like that they kept it faithful to the PS1, but it's kind of a dated control system. And definitely not something I'm used to anymore. Right. At least I've got a nice healthy lead already though. We're coming up to the last lap. Come on. Get some turbos! There's two traps there now, so I think the next person going through the yeah, Coco got hit. And straight between the boxes again. Oh, of course. This is gonna be this is gonna take me ages to get used to again. It's like I'm dreading the time trials. Really dreading. No oh, god. Okay, so I kind of almost messed myself up there with placing the traps. Yeah, there we go. At least that race went a lot better than the first one did. Like a whole lot better. Get some Wumpers! The more Wumper fruit you collect, the faster your cart can go. And we all know, you gotta go fast. Right. So what's next? What have we got next? In fact, I wonder who came second. Was it Jen again? No, it wasn't Jen that time. It was Coco. And a white tiny. Congratulations. You win a trophy. Thank you. I do indeed win a trophy. To get a turbo boost while ooka, ooka. Sliding, wait until the smoke from your exhaust turns black. Then press the power slide button. If you wait too long, you'll hear a backfire sound and miss your chance for a boost. Thank you, Ukuuka. I will take that into consideration. Almost straight into the wall again. Alright, what's this one? Mystery Caves. I can't remember this one as a kid. Let's take a look-see. Okay, see there, that's slightly wrong. It says press and hold L or R1 to start power sliding. You don't, you have to press it twice and hold it on the second time. Alright, mystery caves. Oh, I remember this one now. I remember it now. Alright, let's go! Turtle! I forgot to jump. Boost delicious. Boost delicious. I agree, Sam. I agree. Oh, I still forgot to jump. 
One of these days, I will do it, guys. One of these days, I will do it. Oh, avoid the fireball. Fireball bad. Fireball hurt. Let's give a little present right in the doorway. And I missed the box. And I missed that turtle. But hey, at least I remember how to honk my horn. Come on, turtle, come on. There we go. At least I hit that one. At least I hit that one. Double boost. No, oh, wrong way. I totally meant to drift in the complete opposite direction. Don't worry about it. You know what? I'm going to go this way this time. Let's see what's along this path. Uh, nothing. Let's place another poison pot down. Someone's going to get hit by that. Oh, another one. Yeah, I've got a nice healthy lead now. This top speed being max is really helping me out. Another poison. Right on the turtle. That's kind of evil of me, really. That is kind of evil, but... You know, what can you do? What can you do? And I think that was a penguin. Another poison? Nah, come on. Am I going to get it? Am I going to get it? Nah, he went down too soon. Like, way too soon. Let's go this way this time. Put this right in front of the chest. Ooh, a mask. Now we can just ignore the fireballs as well. Do, 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 do. Please don't go off and get hit. There we go. Oh, wow. Look at that lead I've got on the map. Like, oh, damn. Yeah, I think I'm good this race, guys. I think I'm good. Definitely think I've won this one. Yeah, we'll just shoot a grenade for lols. Right. Oh, 40 coins that time. Nice. And we're actually coming up to the first boss stage already as well. Boost up that turbo. Yes, I swear that's been like the tutorial card every race so far. Come on, loading screen. Come on. There we go. Three races down, three trophies down. I do like how the characters actually change costumes in between races, though. That's actually pretty good. Keeps things fresh rather than getting stale. No tutorial? Yeah, I can remember that one, Uka Uka. I can remember that one. Oh, more paint jobs. Bandicoot Blue. Yeah, I need to beat uh, Ripper 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 Roo before I can get through that door. I still remember that. Right, last race. Last race of the first area. Let's go. I must admit though, it's like I am having some fun. I am having some fun. This this is like taking me back to my childhood, this is. Like it's straight to the feels. The nostalgia. The good old nostalgia. Oh, the sewer track. I remember this one. I never liked this as a kid. I never liked this track. Or should I say, I never liked this track when it came to uh, time trials. It's like, time trials were not fun on this. Watch the chest. Oh, I missed the box. Oh, well, at least I still avoided the thingy, though. Oh, that was lucky. Just scraped by by the skin of my teeth. Let's go left. Place the chest. Uh, yeah, I've got a pretty comfortable lead again already. Let's 
Let's go this way this time. We'll go under. Nothing down there, though. Looks like we'll uh, go back to going up the top way, I think. I swear there was a hidden path somewhere around here, though. I just can't remember. Ah, I've missed it, that's why. Oh, damn, I really should not have gone up the way because I've now missed my... Ah! No, I got hit. They hit me. They got me. They got me. Now I've got to try and get my first place back again. Ooh, a blue shield. Oh, no, it's that old thing. Do, 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 do. Don't mind me, I'll just uh, scoot my way into first. I am so close. No, Cortex. Get back here. Get back here. You're in my first position. Oh, I missed the box. No, don't let me lose. Don't let me lose. Please don't let me lose. Nice. Come on. Let's get it. Let's get the fruit. Let's get the fruit. Let's get the fruit. Let's get the fruit. That was lucky. That was lucky. Right. That very, very close to me. Come on. Nearly at the end. Nearly at the end. Just need that little bit more. And got it. By the skin of the teeth. By the skin of the teeth. Right, missile denied to deny a tracking missile, drop a beaker or a TNT crate. Yeah, so that is the only way to dodge the missiles then. Damn, I was hoping I'd just figure out like some super secret awesome way of dodging them, but... Well, I guess not. I guess not. Yes! Oh wow, that Cortex costume actually looks pretty good. And I like how Polar Bear's just sitting there in a raincoat. Hey, Ripperoo! I am indeed crazy enough to race you. Right, let's do it. Come on, Ripper. Come on. You ain't got nothing on me. Let's go. Let's go. Wait, what weapon does Ripper Roo have? Uh, is Ripper Roo the TNT? Or was he the beakers? Or was he the bombs? Well, I suppose I'm about to find out. Alright. Come on, Ripper. Come on. Oh, I almost hit myself. No, good. Oh, I missed the box. No, let me in front. I can't deal with your TNT. Oh, I keep missing the boxes. was lucky. Come on. Just gotta keep boosting and get a lead going. Hey, I finally got a box. It only took nearly three laps. Yo, Gamer Man, how's it going, bud? Don't worry, I, I got this. I got this. I hope. It would help if I could actually get a box, though. Okay, I've got a bit of a distance between us. Never mind, he's catching up pretty quick, actually. Come on, it's just one last corner! 
Okay, first boss is down and out. Whew, another trophy as well. Oh, two tro- wow, two trophies for winning one race? Huh. I mean, hey, I'll take it. Right, stage number two. Oh yeah, man. Ain't nothing but a chicken wing. I think he has a hairball. I kind of don't want to touch that key right now. I don't think it's hygienic to touch that key anymore. Can you, like, just open the door for me, ripper -o? Right. I wonder what I've unlocked for being the uh, boss. I wonder if I've unlocked ripper as a playable character. Stage number two. Congratulations on opening this new area. Here, you will find four more tracks to race. Good luck. Thank you, Uga Uga. Right. Yeah, I've unlocked Reparu as a playable character. New paint job. New sticker. Right. Now, we could technically go ahead and do some of these. Or we can go on to the uh, second area. I'm going to try this one. Skull Rock. I can't remember what these uh, challenges are for the tokens. Collect every crystal ah, crystals. Time runs out. If you get them all, you will win a prize. Let's do it. How many crystals was there? Was there a lot or was there a few? Uh, I really can't remember. It's been so long since I played this. I think the last time I played this game, I was like, I don't know, 12? So it's probably been like 14 years since I played this. 20 crystals. Okay, that's not too bad. Not too bad at all. It's just a matter of uh, remembering where they all are. I need to go down here, turn around, and go up and jump. There we go. There's two here. No! Oh, come on, come on. There we go. Turning is pretty difficult with this character. Maybe I should have used a different character for this, to be honest. Oh, I missed. Come on, go back, go back, go back. I probably should have had a character with like a really high turning stat for this. I suppose if I fail, I could just uh, change character and then come back in. 30 seconds left, 30 seconds left, 30 seconds left. Come on, come on. Oh, I've got to jump off. Now I've got to go back. I think the last four are up here. There's one, two, three, and there's the fourth. Woo! Arena Explorer. Nice. I wonder what those tokens are actually used for. Maybe they're used to buy characters or cards or stickers? Right, uh, that out of the way, let's go back to the second stage, I think. Well, second stage or should we 100% the first stage first? Like, what do you guys think? 100% or just move on to the second area? Stats Reparil has actually. The more Wumpa fruit you collect, the faster your cart will go. If you collect and hold ten Wumpa fruits, you'll be juiced. Oh, so they affect speed as well. New decal, dual stripes. Okay, right. Let's check a look at uh, Reparil. There he is. Alright, it's got good turning, but the speed is pretty bad. To be fair. I'm gonna go back to crash. Uh, let's take a look at the cards. I'm gonna go in the hovercraft for a race. Nice little red hovercraft I got there. 
Okay, that actually turns super easy, that does. Uh, let's do a speed trial. Yeah, we'll do a rally Christ. Do a good old rally Christ. Get the lowest time you can by racing fast and breaking time crates. Each time crate you break will freeze the clock. If you nice. achieve both. Yeah, I can remember this one. We got this. We got this. Let's do it. Let's do it. Well, this hovercraft does seem to turn super easy. So I'm wondering how that will actually uh, affect things. Alright. Oh, I didn't get my boost. Oh, I missed it. Oh, I missed that box too. Right, I need to do it in 117. That shouldn't be too bad, really. In fact, that should be quite easy to do. As long as I can actually hit some boxes. It should be good, though. Should be good. So I'm definitely gonna get the ones up here this time. There we go. I knew I could get them. Another three seconder. Let's go down for that one down there. Okay. I wonder if I can get all boxes. I should be able to, I think. I'm only missing a few. Okay, maybe I can't get them all. No, I can't get them all. I can't get that one. Oh, well. Oh, I missed. No, I missed that one as well. Well, you know, I mean, two boxes missed. It's not bad. It's not the end of the world, I guess. Oh wow, I'm actually getting really close to the time limit. Come on, come on, come on. Hey, there we go. We got it. Sprinter trophy as well. Well, apparently you can do that in 52 seconds. I'm guessing that's like a perfect run with all the boxes. Shall we do the crystal on that area? Mm. Yeah, let's go ahead and do the crystal there. Why not? Uh, not the crystal, sorry. The, uh, well, yeah, technically the crystal. The crystal collecting one. Go on, Crash. Do your moves. Do your moves. Hey, Victor All, thank you for subscribing, man. I hope you enjoy the stream. Alright. To get around a tight turn or to face a direction quickly, use the Yeah, I know that one. I think I've already had that one actually. Winged arrow decal. Okie dokie. Alright, let's go collect the crystals from there. It's every bit as good as I remember that. I love this game. Oh, it's not collecting crystals. Some letters are hard to find. Right. Okay, so I need to come first and collect the letters. Huh. Where were the letters? I really can't remember any of them. This could be interesting, actually. Right, let's do this. Let's do it. Let's do it to it. Now, where are these lies? Okay, there's the first one. 
Well, I missed it. There's one. Right, I know where the C is. So I passed that. Now I just need the R. Which is... I think that... No, it's there. C is round here. Uh, sorry, not the C, the R is round here. There it is. Alright, now I just need to come first. No! God damn it, polar bear. Oh, and I can't avoid that. <sighs> Did you really have to missile me, guys? Like, I mean, really? You know, maybe show a bit of compassion, a bit of love, a bit of support. Oh, I'm gonna hit the wall. Oh, I hit the wall. Pro drifter. Pro, pro, pro drifter. That polar bear has a super low top speed. How is he staying so far in front? Ah, oh, I missed. Come on. Give me something I can use. Yes, I got him. Okay. Okay, I got this now. Yeah, I got it. Easy peasy. Maybe not so easy, but still. Easy. Spare change. Right, so that's that first uh, track completely completed then. Let's move on to track number two. These loading screens are kind of long, actually, to be fair. Hmm, that's a funny looking polar bear down in the bottom left there. Right, it's what we got now. You get a hang time turbo from jumping. The longer you're in the air, the bigger the turbo you get when you. Ah, uh, yeah, that's just the the jump boost. Just the jump boost. More decals, okie dokie. How do I reverse? That's a pretty good horn though, to be fair. Oh, you literally just hold down on the de uh, on the analog stack. I wonder if it would be easier playing this using the D-pad. Maybe not. Maybe not. I'm going to stick to uh, the analog stick, I think. Definitely going to stick to the analog stick. Right. Now, where are the letters in this stage? Um, I think one of them was towards the very end. I can't quite remember where. That and they are kind of small as well, so it can be a little hard to see. Either that or maybe it's just because I'm blind as a bat, you know what I mean? I'm sure it's one of them. Alright, first letter, first letter. There it is. And I got it, nice. There's the second one. Okay, where's the third? If I remember rightly, I need to go this way. Yeah, it's that. There it is. Super boost. Okay, I'm not really sure what that trophy was for. Oh, well, that's all three letters now, though, so I can just win the race. A lovely little boosts. <gasps> Wait, what? I put a... no. I used a potion there, though, so that shouldn't have hit me. 
Oh man. Hey, Carries. Welcome to the stream, my man. Thank you for subscribing. I hope you enjoy the show. Come on, give me something good. There we go. I can use that. Straight over the TNT, like a boss. Oh, I think that was my own as well. I think I just went into my own potion. Was my Lulu a guide? Fair enough. I hope you enjoyed it. It's like Atelier is probably one. No, he's got a no right at the end. Right at the end. Oh my days. Uh, but yeah, guys, uh, Atelier probably one of my favourite games of all time. To be fair, so I think I've done a guide for pretty much every atelier in like the last seven or eight years something like that anyway oh, they got in the way so I couldn't jump them did I uh, did you frustrate me no why would you frustrate me Oh, no, not at all. It's mainly, um, like, this is not as... Oh, crap, I meant to be going for this one. Uh, it's definitely not as easy as the original on the PS1. So it's like, rather than getting a big, huge lead going, uh, they do actually tend to stick pretty close to you. Oh, I jumped over at that time. Only looking got the parts and little that I'm stuck at. Don't want to ruin my own play. Yeah, yeah, I understand that. I understand that. It's like, I I'm guessing it's mainly the uh, alchemy riddle that you're looking up. Something like that. I missed it again. No, I've got to restart. So like I can't win the race without that. And hey, Reaper Pain, welcome to the channel, my man. I hope you are enjoying the stream and thank you for subscribing. Oh, I didn't get the boost again. Oh, I'm so bad. Alright, I got it that time. Now I'm probably going to mess up and miss one of the later ones, I bet. Uh, didn't realize that using items during interrupt doesn't count. Yeah, there's two separate uh, challenges for them. Like, there's some specific to interrupt items, and there's some specific to normal items. It just do really doesn't make... Uh, well, it doesn't really make it clear, which is a bit of a hassle, I know. Unfortunately, uh, the past couple of Atelier games have had some pretty poor translations and help text in that, uh, those sorts of situations. No, there's nothing that... Oh, I dodged that by the skin of my teeth. I mean, unfortunately, there's nothing that can really be done about poor like, information in the game. I mean, uh, what chapter are you up to, Karis? You pretty far into the game, or are you still pretty early? Oh, Cortex is coming up behind me again. I don't want to do two tries, although Cortex was right up behind me again. Hey, Reaper! Can't wait for this game. Uh, dude, it is awesome. Like, it is straight back to the childhood. I mean, I'm a. Uh, 
And we're chapter 7, I think. Was too busy synthesizing. Yeah, I, I completely get that. I completely get that. I was the same way in all Atelier games. Like, I always start really messing around with the synthesis a bit too early. But, uh, you know, I mean, it's what the game's for, really. But, uh, yeah, Reaper, like, the game is insanely awesome. Like, the only thing, like, the only complaint I have is they kept the original PS1 control layout. So it's like it's X to go, R1, L1 to jump, things like that. I would have preferred an updated control scheme where it's like R2 to accelerate and things. But, you know, I mean, it just takes a little getting used to. Alright, time trial for the Ruse Tubes. Let's go. Let's do it to it. Oh, I can make a bomb explode while it's rolling. Well, that could be useful, actually. That could indeed be useful. Alright. Time trial. Let's do this. Now I've just got to try and remember where all the boxes are. I wonder if you actually get some... Oh, I missed that one. Looks like I'm not getting them all after all. But yeah, I wonder if you actually get something for collecting all the boxes. But that ain't gonna happen in this race because I missed uh, that jump on at the start. Okay. And I don't think I can get two at the same time, unfortunately. Nope, I missed that again. Yeah, that jumps pretty high up, to be fair, actually. Oh, and it uh, sounded like there was a motorbike out the front then. God, you gotta love living on a busy main road. So much traffic going past. Get the free, get the free. Okay. Yeah, I'm definitely not getting them all. Wow, I'm actually really close to the time limit already as well. I don't think I'm gonna... Clear this. Ah, an extra 10 seconds off. That could be useful. Come on. No, I still missed it. Like, I really can't delay that jump any later than I did then either. That's going to be a bit of a hassle to get. I don't think I'm going to do it this time, though. It's like, yeah, I've got no more boxes and I'm right on the timer. And I missed. Oh, nah, yeah, I've got no chance of doing it. Yeah, no chance. Time to restart. That first jump, though, was really awkward. Right. Let's start off easy and go for this one. Nope, still missed. And yeah, if I hit them in the last race, I would have actually uh, been able to do it as well. Because there's enough seconds there that I could have finished the race. It's the drifting that's a bit of a hassle, though. It's like, it's definitely not as smooth as uh, some of the more recent games. And it doesn't help. Nah, missed it again. It doesn't help that I've uh, recently played Sonic, which also had a rather weird drifting system in it. Yeah, I'm really close to that timer again. I think I'm probably going to fail this again. again. I need to hit one of these jump boxes. No, I'm not even close. <sighs> uh, yeah, I think, I, I think I'm going to fail this race. So I'm really up there on the timer again. Maybe I could do with someone with a 
bit more top speed than Crash. Uh, was there still... There's still one more box, but I can't remember. Two seconds? This is going to be close. Ah! Less than a second. Less than a second. And I only missed those three boxes at the jump again. Is this going to be like the uh, Crash 1, 2 and 3 remake where the jumps have to be like so precise? There we go. Just got to get my boost going before I jump it seems. Uh, boost lighting is your best option on getting those boxes. Yep, I just realized that carries. Thank you. Hopefully now I can get all 32 boxes as well. Maybe not. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get all those boxes in two laps. I really wish I could change the boost slide to something like, uh, I don't know, square or something. Missed it again. So come on. I got this. I got this. It's like going full try hard mode right now. Yeah, I missed them all again. Hmm. Didn't even jump! Oh my days, I'm so bad. Alright, come on. Nah, I'm like nowhere near finishing. I, yeah, I'm gonna fail this one as well, I think. It's like, come on. Nah, I missed that last one as well. Nope. Alright, we'll try it once more. One more try for this stage. One more try. If I don't do it, I'm going to come back with a, a different racer. It's like Crash's top speed's a little slow. And I missed. Oh, of course I did. Boosts going. Okay, I got a couple of them that time. Need to boost slide at every opportunity. So that's the thing, right? It tells you that you uh, can just like hold L1 and R1 in to start a boost slide, but you can't. You have to press it twice. So it's like you have to press it twice, and then on your second press, you have to hold it. But the problem is, like, it really doesn't want to start straight away. So it's like, you have to be sort of mid-turning when you land. So it's really awkward to start a boost off at some points. Okay, I swear I hit that then. Like, am I going blind or did I just literally, like, go through that box? Uh, the hovercraft is actually one of the beginner carts. Oh, okay. Thanks, it's a map. I'm going to come back with a different racer on that one. It's like, it's the same as the races. Crash is just too slow compared to the others. I'm going back to someone with top speed. Maxed out. Right. 
character. Mm, yeah, we'll go as Dingo. Mm, let's just go with the classic cart. Alright, we'll... Uh, mm, yeah, actually, we'll try one more speed trial with Dingo this time. I miss playing this game. Yeah, man, like, it's... It's just a straight in the feels game. Like this is this is childhood to me right now. Like this is literally how I spent I don't even know how much time. This and like the early Final Fantasies. Like, I spent my entire childhood on games like this. Definitely getting around a lot quicker though. Oh yeah, definitely a lot quicker around. And didn't jump. That one's on me, that one is. Oh, the car it's the uh, characters that affect performance, guys. Uh, the cards don't do anything there, pretty much just visual. Or at least they don't show any stats for the cards anyway. Although I've noticed the uh, hovercraft definitely turns much easier compared to the normal cards. Whether that's just like a placebo or whether it actually happens, I don't know. I'm probably going to fail this again, actually. Hang on, I do still have a fair few boxes around, so... Maybe I'll do it? Yeah, I've done it. Yeah, see, I mean, that's like six seconds difference there between Dingo and Crash. And that's with less boxes overall as well. I want to stick to Dingo. It's like top speed characters are just way too good. Which is a shame. Alright, so that's a second stage that's actually 100% complete now. So just two more to go. And then the first world is completely 100%ed. Ding dong, ding dong, ding dong. But they turn them poorly, don't they? Um, the top speed ones turn a tiny bit worse. Definitely nowhere near as like bad as it makes out by looking at the stats. It's like they still turn pretty fine, to be fair. But their top speed is way higher. Like the stats that it shows you on the page are skewed as heck. Two stages to go. So, where are the letters on this one? Let's see. Where are they? There's one. No, oh, you can't shoot missiles back. Let's try this way first. Come on, letters, where are you? Where are you? Oh, 
letters. There's another. Alright, so I'm missing one letter. One letter. Is it down here? Uh, no, not down there. I wonder if it's down the other path down here on the right. Come on, see, where are you? Uh, yes, it's the PS4 carries. More specifically, the PS4 Pro. I feel like I must have gone past the sea. I've got to be blind or something. Uh, where is it? Hmm. I feel like I must be messing it somewhere. Gotta be messing it. But where? Oh, where's the sea? You can jump on top of them, guys. Uh, I did this earlier, but it didn't get flattened. Alright, where's this C? Where's the R? I definitely think I'm blind and I must just be messing it. It's probably going to be in some super obvious spot as well. Like, can any of you guys... Well, have any of you guys seen the sea anywhere? Well, it is here. Am I just generally blind and I'm like just completely blanking it every lap or Like I generally can't see it anywhere Shortcut. Uh, oh, do you mean through the uh, rubble? I've checked through there. It's like, I'll go through there this lap. Yeah, I see. No C there. There's another shortcut I'm missing. There it is. Right, I found it. Wow, that is super hard to see. That is so blended into the background. Wow, that is... 
Wow, I can't believe that. That is so well hidden. Like, it blends into the background. See, I thought it was on one of the ramps, but when we're constantly going over them and not seeing them, I was starting to doubt myself. Alright, it's this one on the corner. There it is. Oh, and I missed it. Oh, of course. That's pretty... Yeah, I... Oh, I missed the T then as well. Oh, I'm really not having much luck this race. Well, no, that C is evilly placed. Like, that is really, really hard to see. Oh, I jumped over it by accident. Alright, let's get it this time. Let's get it this time. There we go. Okay. Now I need to get the T. There we go. And now I just need to come first. Jobs are good. Uh, not the missile. Oh, my days now. At least there was a boost there to get me back up to speed. Damn though, that that letter was super well hidden. I can't believe it took me like, I don't know, nine laps or something like that to find? Well, that took me ages. Ah, I knew that was gonna happen. Come on, Coco's catching up! I don't even know what to say to that. Come back here, Coco. Come back here. Come on, give me something good. Give me something good. No, I don't want potions. I want something to attack Coco with. No, she's gonna win! Oh, uh, just as I first managed to collect all four letters. Alright. At least now I know where the letters are, though. Now that I know where the letters are, it shouldn't be too difficult to actually win this race. Do you mind? Like, constantly getting in my way. You can bounce over drivers with the boost. Yep. Alright. Here's the C. Aim straight at it. There we go. Now I just need the T. The T. Oh, I missed the box. Move around gently. There we go. Right. We got this. Now I just gotta come first. And look at that lead. That's a nice healthy lead right there. to bomb back. Hopefully I'll hit someone. Which I didn't unfortunately. Oh, Coco's gone all on the left path. She's definitely going to get hit by a potion. Maybe not. Maybe not. I think Crash got hit by one now. At least looking at the map anyway. Oh, I slowed down. Come on, Coco's catching up! Okay. Last lap. Okay, Coco got hit. Coco got hit. That's beneficial. There we 
Reaper without any speed, that shortcut kills your momentum now. Yes, it does. It's like, there's a lot of, um, should I say, like, ground patches that really reduce your speed. It's like the shortcut in uh, Rue's Tunnel does the same. I'm not really sure why I didn't actually bounce there. Seemed to just drive straight through the tail. And there we go. Another one done and dusted. Alright. So now we've still got to do the time trial there. At least when it loads, we'll be doing the time trial there. Although first, I'm definitely going to have a drink. <laughs> they made the walls in Papu's Pyramid and Oxide Station out of bounds as well. No more nine second laps. Hmm. That could be interesting then. I kind of want to see uh, speedrunners tackle this game to be fair, if a lot of these shortcuts are being taken out. Well, I'm saying that speedrunners will probably have uh, a whole new bag of tricks within like a day of release. What, no flag girls? Fooey. Yeah, no flag girls, no flag girls. Maybe one day, Carries. Maybe one day. Right. Relic time. Let's do this. Now, this one should be pretty easy, to be fair. So, I'm not really expecting much challenge from this one. Oh, I missed. Damn. Oh, I missed a box there. Oh, and there's only one second box that way. Okay. Oh, I dodged that fireball by the skin of my teeth. Going pretty. Oh, I slowed down there. Okay, so I can't really go up there because of a slowdown. This lap's not too bad, though. This lap, uh, you know, pretty decent time. And now I know where a lot of the boxes are as well. So it should be much, much easier. Oh, I still missed that one, though. Go, baby girl. No, I missed another box. Yeah, it's kind of weird that they've made them playable like characters, but just completely left them out of the uh, base game. But since it's Activision, I'm guessing paid DLC. Uh, certain people would have complained about what, Nox? You mean the uh, finger girls? The flag girls? Oh, everything will be free. Hmm, that's not too bad, then. Maybe they just weren't ready for release, then, I guess. Like, maybe they're still tweaking things. But then that just goes back to, like, releasing an incomplete game, like, before it should be. Come on, 
five seconds. There we go. Hmm, that was a little close. Some people would complain about the trophy girls being objectifying women. Dude, it's just snowflakes. Like, it's seriously just snowflakes. It's like, people will look for a reason to complain about everything. It's like, no matter what happens in this day and age, there will be at least, like, one side complaining about it. I mean, it's like all that, uh, trouble with uh, Cyberpunk uh, 2077 at the moment. Like, it's just ridiculous. I mean, at the end of the day, it's a game. It's like, people don't point out all these things in movies or TV shows and things like that. So, why do they have to point it out in games? Like, I, it just doesn't make any sense. Because it's only games that it gets pointed out in. Alright, last stage in the first area. Let's get that 100%. Oh, this was the subway. Well, yeah, the sewer. I really hope I don't have to take the shortcut for a latter, because I could never get that as a kid. Where are these lattice? Okay, I think I just saw one. Let's look up here first. Right, now let's actually go and try. Nope, I missed. Restart, because I'm never going to pull that race back. Right, let me see if I can see them on the intro video. No, it's not showing any of the letters there. Yeah, probably not, probably. And yeah, guys, it's a good one when you get it. Oh, I missed it. It's a good shortcut when you get it, but when you don't get it, it's game over. Like, you've, you've lost that race. You'll never pull it back if you mess that up. There's the art. Okay, where's the last one? There he says. And I know where the T is, because I missed it. No! Don't shoot the rockets at me! Oh, a mask, nice. Go, 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 go! Hit them all, hit them all, hit them all! Well, I got two of them. That's not too bad. Now, I've got to try and get this jump. No! I hit the pipe! I hit the pipe! Oh my days, I hit the pipe. I don't believe that. Uh, a lot of new players streaming are getting stonewalled at pinch drive. Uh, getting kind of painful to watch. Uh, pinch drive knocks? I can't remember a stage called Pinch Dry or like a person called Pinch Dry. Is it like one of the later stages or? Fourth boss. Ah, I got you, I got you. You know what? I'm going to try getting the ladder down here. Okay, yeah, you absolutely do not get it that way. And now I've got to restart. I mean, to be fair, the difficulty has been knocked up. Ah, yeah, I, I know the one you mean now. I know the one you mean. But yeah, the difficulty has been knocked up quite a bit. Like, there's two modes. There's Nitro Fueled and Classic. Classic mode is pretty much the same as, like, the PS1 version. And Nitro Fueled mode... Oh, missed it again. Uh, Nitro Fueled mode is three difficulties. Easy, normal, or hard. 
So it's like, depending on what people are playing on, like, I imagine it could be quite difficult. Like, this is normal difficulty on Nitro Fueled mode, and it's definitely uh, a little harder than what it was back on the PS1. Like, definitely. So, I mean, if someone's playing on uh, hard or something like that, yeah, I can imagine some nightmarish trouble. Alright, last ladder. Okay, now I just gotta come first. No! Oh, that was so good, Dan. It's all normal nitro fueled. Hard mode AI is all set to enter his time trial ghost levels. Hmm. I think I'm going to stay off hard mode for a while. Maybe I'll do it after I complete my first playthrough, you know, unlock everything first. Get used to the uh, controls, get used to the new stages, things like that. Then I'll go for a hard mode playthrough. Oh, Cortex is right up my ass. Ah, oh, no! Oh, wait, no, it's not Cortex, it's Jin again. Like, Jin seems to be really overpowered in this game. Like, he is super fast, even though he has a low speed stat. I got this. I got this easy, no problem. Oh, that's gonna hit me! No, it's not. Okay. No, oh, I failed that. the hole this time. Oh, that is literally the same potion I placed there last time as well. God damn it. We're straight into my own trap. So, funny thing, like, Engine's supposed to have a low top speed, but his top speed is actually super, super fast. Like, I was playing as uh, Crash on the first stage when I first started playing, and Engine just darted ahead and I could not catch up to him. Like, I had to actually change to a full top speeded character just to get ahead of MGN. It's like, his top speed is supposed to be like two or three bars, but it's definitely a lot quicker than that. Either that or the AI is just cheating. Ding dong, ding dong, ding dong. Oh, green engine, nice. All right, just one last thing to do, and that's the rally. He may be channeling the power of Nolan North. Yeah, maybe, maybe. He's definitely getting uh, that extra speed from somewhere. Right, last one for the first area. Got this, got this, got this. Okay, let's get that, because it's a free. Oh, I missed the two, god damn it. Got the free. I'm definitely not going for the shortcut, because I know I won't actually get it. Oh, I keep missing all these boxes. Ooh, what's the battle? Okay, 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 okay. Yeah, I know I'm never gonna get that shortcut. So I'm just, I'm not even gonna attempt going for it. Oh, I missed those three as well. Oh, come on, straight between the lines. I'm really not having a very good time in this one. 
I'm really struggling to get these boxes. Right, let's try this again. Okay. Oh, I missed the three. Okay, I got that three though, so it's all good. Let's get that one, and get this one. Get these. There we go, we're getting some nice time saves here. Barrel! Ooh, I thought it was going to clip me then. Alright, there's a free just in the side there. Got it. Okay. Now I need to jump through the top because I haven't been that way yet. Oh, it's a two second. Nice. Right, where are the boxes I'm missing from here? Like, I know I'm missing the ones from the shortcut, but there is no way I am attempting that because I'm actually on a okay time right now. So I really don't want to mess up and uh, clip that. Oh, I missed that. I missed it. Oh, I'm, I missed that one as well, damn. <gasps> the barrel! No! Go, go, go! This will get you off Destiny 2. Nice. You know a game's good when it pulls you away from another game that you love playing. Okay, that one was pretty easy. Right. So that is the first stage 100% completed. So now we get to go to Area 2. When it loads up, we get to go to area two. There we go. Thank you, Nox. Thank you. See, you just need a character with good top speed. It's like, I don't think I've actually succeeded in anything plain as Crash. The only things I... Well, the only time I've actually completed levels is with someone with top speed. Oh, a new sticker. More stickers. Oh wow, a lot of new stickers actually. Right, so that's the first world completely done. Let's move on to number two. Okay, what have we got? Uh, apparently nothing here. But let's go with... Is this where Oxide was? No, this is actually the save. He's one like Pente. He's a speed type now. Uh, I will take a look. I don't think so, though, actually. Alright, let's give it a save. Right. And uh, let's move on to the next stage, then. Yeah, there's Oxide. Hey, Oxide, how you doing, buddy? Don't worry, I'll come back for you later today. Right, now we're going to some temples, though. Right, so we've got two races to do here. But I am going to be doing them later, guys. I do have a few errands to run, and the stream has been coming up to two hours now. So I'm going to leave this here, and I might stream again later today. Um, if not, then you can catch all the playthroughs over on YouTube. But I just want to say thanks for watching. I hope you guys have had a good time. I know I've had an awesome time playing this game, and I'm going to love finishing it off and getting that platinum trophy. But I do hope to see you guys again later, so I will catch you later.